Grand Junction High School held an open house Tuesday evening for community members to tour the campus. This highlighted school security concerns and ballot measure 4A as Election Day approaches. KRX 5's Adrian Thomas has more on the community's school tour and ballot measure 4A. Measure 4A will ask voters in November to approve the construction of a new high school. Among the issues behind the ballot measure include the age of the school and general safety. We have 71 doors that have to be secured in case of any type of emergency event. Um, those are doors to the, the outside. Um, we have some doors that go straight out to the parking lot, so um, it's, it's always a concern. Also in attendance tonight were members of Citizens for School District 51. They're campaigning for the bond measure to be passed. We are trying to rebuild a brand new Grand Junction High School, which was built in 1956 and has not had significant improvements um, in its lifetime. In addition to some of the safety issues behind the bond measure, the age of the school poses a concern to the campaign. Right now there's no fire suppression in the school. Um, we have significant issues in uh, the roof and we have significant safety issues in between all of the different outbuildings in the school. Despite some of the issues at the center of the bond measure campaign, some former students of Grand Junction High School still haven't quite made up their mind. I haven't totally made up my mind on that yet, which is the main reason I'm here tonight, to uh, get a tour, try to see what some of the problems are. The final decision will be made by voters in November. First on the Western Slope, Adrian Thomas, KREX 5 News.